Hey guys, I'm going to do a review on this product that I have been wanting to do a review for a long time, but I wanted to try it out before I did the review. Try it out for a while before I did the review. It is the CoverGirl Exact Eye Lights Mascara, and this is in um, Black Pearl for the brown eyes. I have the four different eye shades, and it's supposed to brighten the eye. And this is what the brush, um, bristle, the brush looks like. It's kind of, it's with the rubbery brush, and if, you don't know if you can see the ends, the front of it, it kind of doesn't have a lot of bristles, and it kind of tapers inward, which is good, like the end right here. So it's good for those inner corners, outer corners, those baby um, eyelash hairs. And um, it kind of compares with the CoverGirl Lash Blast, but if you're not used to this big, big, big bris um, brush, you can use the um, CoverGirl Exact Eyelash, it's the good alternative and um, it's one of those rubbery bristles not one of the traditional ones traditional mascara has the bristles like a toothbrush thing um yeah if you know what I mean but this one is the rubbery one I find the rubbery ones work better because they tend to separate your lashes kind of elongate them kind of give it a tiny bit of volume that's what this one does it doesn't give you lots of lots of volume nor does it give you like super like um uh, fake lashless fake lashes kind of length. I don't know, my lashes are pretty stubble, pretty short, pretty go out this way. So maybe that's why. If you have longer lashes, this might, when you put it on, might make your lashes look like you have fake lashes or whatnot. <clears throat> so I don't know. And um, also it depends how you curl your lashes. If you curl them really long time, it's really good. And what I like to do is hold the curling curl eyelash curler for 20 seconds because I have really short stubby lashes and then pump five times. And then the fifth time, hold it really tight and then release it out. And then put this on. It really works with the index card trick. I have a video on that if you want to go check it out, how to apply it. So, it doesn't, so we can go totally upward, but it won't go on your lid and mess up your eye makeup. And I will totally recommend this. And um, I will not recommend you using uh, eyelash curler after you apply it. It does will kind of flake out. But when you apply it, it doesn't go under here and it stays on all day. It's great. It does hold the curl. The thing is, if you put too many coats, I recommend max three coats. I do three coats. More coats than that, it really, really will start to reverse the effect. Your lash will get really droopy, and then it will go down and it'll re reverse the effect. So yeah, this is the CoverGirl Lash Blast. Really recommend it. I don't know how much it's cost. Eight bucks, nine bucks. I got it in a kit with the CoverGirl Exact Eyelights thing. That's why I got it. But uh, it's a really good investment for a drugstore mascara, and it does a bit of a uh, bit of everything. A little voluming, a little bit of length gives length. I really like the length. And I really like how it separates your lashes and it fans them out. That's what I like the best. Makes your eyes really wide. But the thing about it saying that it brightens the eye, I don't know if it brightens the eye, but it does make your eye look awake and wider and um, bigger. Yeah. So this is a good product. Go check it out. If you are not into the big brushes like the Carla Lash Blast, check this one out. And um, thanks for watching. See you all soon.